progress by teachers so it shows you the level and the subject and this is the class uh, there's a need to explain this donut more carefully after I found out the true meaning so basically the overall progress of the marks for all assignment because there are assignments that are being assigned to this class so all of them will appear here uh, containing questions they are tag or untag so tag means that they are tagged to the syllabus here the content map so the content is actually this one so you can see that the marks do add up correctly so the the total is seven and two because in this subs in this higher note of the learning objective there's a seven mark and a two mark so you add it together that's nine then then why is it showing ten is because this is the tag and the untag questions in all assignments so there is actually one question here that is untag so therefore the answer is 10 for the total marks so it, this can reconcile the awarded marks is 3 plus 1 so that's 4 then how do you get 5 again it's back to the tag and untag so there's an untag question here which the student got it correct so that's why the marks is 5 okay now if you go to monthly you will see that this is uh, attempted in the month of October okay and the student if you drill down you can see that this student got four out of the total of four the student got one mark this student out of five got three marks so you can see the details so again the trick is to add these two numbers together so nine so where, where did the extra uh, mark come from again it is from the untagged okay so therefore it can reconcile the the, the tag and the untagged question mark together with the 10 and the 5 is of course the the 4 here plus the untagged which is also one mark so that's why there is 5 now for the usage of all this data what is the recommended usage uh, it is good that all these questions that you find here in the tech resource are the topical practice questions so if it's relevant to this particular topic in this particular content map then we would like to tag it here uh, then it, this will show up in both the content map date, date table as well as the donut okay now if you decide that for example there are certain bonus questions this is this question is extremely difficult and it's not a very fair thing to put it in the content map to show up in the learning progress okay that's example then but that yet you want to encourage students to try because there's obvious reasons so if they keep trying they, they are motivated and you want them to try so therefore you will put it in the content map but untapped so that it doesn't disadvantage them by showing uh, low scores over here but yet if they do well they go and try the question they get it correct it shows up in the donut for the student <coughs> the use case for exclusion so this is the excluded so in this case this question here is excluded so maybe this question is uh, tricky you know then then uh, you don't want to include it here into the donut as well as the table then you will exclude it then there are obviously some cases where there are questions like you ask student how are they feeling today you know well-being questions so you you can also don't uh, you can also exclude them from being included here as well as you don't tag them so these are the basic four data sets that you can play with